So I guess it makes some sense after taking a look at the sump here to take a little look at the tank. Um, like I said, 55 uh, gallon. It's been running for about a year. Um, so what have we got? got my uh, our clowns there. Uh, they love their their bubble tip uh, anemone back there. Um, got some some zoas over here. It's a beautiful chunk I picked up for ten bucks on sale uh, a month or so ago. Um, this Duncan coral I've had. I just fragged it uh, a week ago. Um, so there's the uh, original piece, and then these are four frags I took off it. Uh, well, yeah, did that about two weeks ago. Um, a star polyp over here. Uh, Feather duster, some some mushrooms. These all over the last year have gone from two to I don't know. There's twenty or so pieces of, of that. Um, I'm gonna take got a little extra circulation here with, with this pump, um, and then uh, added my first uh, small polyp. Uh, there it is. <laughs> um, about uh, two weeks ago, it seems to be doing well. Um, and uh, leather over here that has literally doubled in size, and, and the, I got him the same time I got the SPS two weeks ago. Um, doing very well. Um, since I did all the uh, phosphate removals and we got down to 0 0.06, I've been feeding a little more. Bubble tip loves to be fed and is much more vibrant when fed. Um, I do, I am gonna probably be putting in some LED lighting here in a little while. I've got, you know, T5s running right now. They're getting very old, um, a year old, so probably too old. But one nice thing with the phosphate removal, you know, I used to be scrubbing the front of the tank here uh, daily. And now uh, I haven't scrubbed it in a couple days and you can see that, uh, you know, we're actually you know, really not anything going on. Also had a lot of uh, growth on the bottom during the daylight hours. Um, nothing happening now at all. You can see back from when I did have a lot of phosphates, a lot of algae still on the rocks here. Um, but I do have a uh, emerald crab in, in here somewhere. I don't know where he is, but he seems to like that. So he's slowly uh, reducing some of that stuff. Um, even this thing I got here, this Zoa here, I fragged him um, a little bit uh, a few weeks ago. Um, I had some pieces drop off and just colonize uh, over over there. They seem to be doing well. But uh, so that's the that's the tank. I'm very happy that uh, my phosphate reduction plan has uh, has worked quite well. So there you go.